Hey guys, Mike here with Grassroots K9, and I'm going to talk to you a little bit about our board and train program and the freedoms you get with off-leash obedience. Senna, here. Good man. Break. Good. We'll get to you after this. So guys, one of the things that we get when we have this kind of off-leash obedience and control is, yeah, you can look cool and you can brag to your friends a bit, but the even cooler thing is that your dog, so this is our board and train center right here, um, ends up getting way more freedom. They get the, the ability to be off-leash and run around and do actual dog shit instead of being so cooped up and you're in panics. There's another dog, a uh, puppy over there that's training right now and Senna does want to go play, uh, but Right now we're saying it's not appropriate and he understands the boundaries, he's happy. Um, Santa, break! Oh man. So he gets to do what he wants. Here, let the people see you, bud. Break! All right, can you get him? That's our boy Senna there. Pretty good dog, man. Pretty good dog. He's a what a bully should be to me. This is what an American bully should be. Senna, here! Yeah, buddy! Look at him. Coming in like lightning. Hey bud, sit. Good man. All right, so in th these results, results with, you know, having a dog that can be trusted off leash. Don't mind our trampoline back there. Our goats are over there. I don't know if you could see them. Um, is that, again, he gets freedom. Uh, we're, we're able to communicate with him effectively off leash. Um, and one of the tools that we use to do that uh, is a remote collar, right? So Senna's on his e-collar. Um, he hasn't been stimmed since he's been out here, um, but he operates on, I don't know if you can see that. It's a low, di uh, probably hard. There we go, focus. Low, dis low distraction environment. So he's on a level two right now. Um, so level two and it goes up to 100. Uh, that's where Senna works at. Uh, so. With great power comes great responsibility. Here, let's check him out. There he is, checking out, going down by the pond. There's a bird nest over there. You don't want to mess with that guy. He's pretty crabby. All right, let's give him a, see if he goes and explores and we'll give him a recall. Mid P recall, let's see how he does. Senna, here! Yeah, a boy. Look at that pretty guy. Look at that pretty guy. Give him a payment for a job well done. Break. Awesome, bud. So again, one of the one of the reasons why we're able to have this kind of effective training system um, with these dogs, uh, it's you know, a little to do with us, but a lot more to do with the environment that he goes home to, right? Uh, Senna, Senna's owners are very, very committed to him working um, and, and, and him understanding and them doing their part in upkeeping the training. So again, you know, we can really help you guys and put that foundation down, but if you're not gonna commit and put in the work that needs to happen when he's at home, um, you're not gonna get these results. So make sure you're committed and you understand that it's gonna be a lot of work. And then your dog gets to do these free things and he gets to run around and explore and be a dog and you know and you can have peace of mind that when you need him to do something he's gonna do it so a little bit different of a video than usual uh, that, that you're used to seeing um, but all of this stuff you, you can't have off-leash behavior with your dog if you don't have on-leash behaviors with your dog if they're not trained on a leash you're not gonna have them trained off leash so they need to first understand all of that foundation um, and again we want them to do it with this happy attitude and tail up feeling good about himself while he's out here and just knowing what the answers are right when I say here he knows that the answer to that question is get back over to his owner or get back over to me right now right um, when I ask him to walk and to heal he knows that he's gonna stay right there when I ask him to down he knows what the responses are so we build confidence in that um, and then we move on and progress so we'll give Senna a big high five good job bud 
Oh, what's that? And we'll talk to you guys soon.